What is up guys, Hitman Ham here with some XCON Enemy Unknown, and uh, the game just dropped yesterday I believe, so I decided to pick it up and make some videos of it. It's a pretty unique game, um, it's a turn-based strategy game, kind of like chest, I will be moving my human squad, and uh, bunkering them down undercover, or taking some shots at some aliens, and um, oh look at that little guy back there, oh what's up, and he's gone. Um, I'll be doing my moves, and then he will be doing his moves, and so on like that. Um, I'm pretty excited to play this game. I don't think it really got as much hype as I think it should have, because I don't even know. I didn't really even hear of XCOM until maybe about a month ago, and I didn't even know that it was actually off an older game that they came out with. But uh, it's pretty sweet. Not too many games out there are about aliens and taking over the world. <laughs> yeah, right? Yeah. But uh, there's that little guy again. But uh, let's get this going. I am going to play on normal difficulty. And it's cool because you build your squad up, um, they get promotions, um, and they just learn. They get uh, better guns, you learn about more technology from the aliens, and you can actually use that against them. And uh, you have to make some very hard decisions in this game to save some countries and let the other country kind of die off. But uh, there's two possibilities exist. Either we are alone on this universe or we are not. Both are equally terrifying. Oh, we got some freaking meteors coming down. This is some Inception crap right here, though, dude. Can you just hear like the? <laughs> oh, so what fell from space? Look at this nosy human crowd. Yeah. Okay, right now I would be screaming and probably running the other way. A bright lime green light is probably the biggest indicate. Oh, okay, you're gonna touch it. Yeah, you guys deserve what just happened to you. I'm sorry. You don't touch things like that. It's like sucking them in, too. And this guy. Yeah. You think you're actually gonna get away from that crap? No. Ugh. I must say, having aliens come to this world would probably be pretty scary. I mean, yeah, of course it would be scary just because, you know, it's a whole different race, but just in general, because some people would be like, oh, it'd be so cool because then we know we're not alone and all this, but uh, if these things actually came and just wanted to, like, harvest us and learn about us, that would be pretty bad. Hello, Commander. Who is this guy? In light of the recent extraterrestrial like, uh, incursion, the age, this the, uh, Council of Nations has agent convened of to approve the games. activation of the XCOM project. Agent 47. You have been chosen to lead yeah. this initiative to oversee our first oh, locking and loading. Last line Very of nice. See, it looks pretty cool. They got uh, their on this um, country's flags on the back since everybody is to coming together to fight off the alien race. So, uh, set aside all the world problems. They got one big one and they need to deal with it. Good It'd be luck, pretty cool Commander. to see in real life, actually, if something did happen and everyone would just come together. But, uh, yeah, it's probably not going to happen anytime soon. But XCOM, enemy unknown. Like I said, I'm really excited, guys. This game's gonna be fun. That was the last transmission, sir. Patch that me through to Voodoo 3 1. Okay, so Operation Devil's Moon. Unknown bogeys are classified. Uh, reclassified as intelligent, possibly extraterrestrial life. Unexplained events. We're being deployed to Germany. This guy's gonna cut me off at impact Several site. German FSL. Blah, 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 I report it. Of a down satellite. We now believe these objects to be extraterrestrial. Heading over to nature. Munich, Germany. Shortly after impact, German officials received reports of mass hysteria and freak weather around one of the impact zones. Then things went dark. At 2100 hours. A chopper carrying a German military recon team went down in the area. Oh man, that chick to the left is just jamming bomb. out to some music or something. As you know, <laughs> Germany is a member of the council. Get psyched up, ready to go. Our, assistance. our mission is to assess the situation on the ground, ascertain the current status of the German recon team, and investigate the extraterrestrial objects. Central out. Okay. So, we're, like I said, we are in Munich, Germany. Our mission objectives is to access situation at impact site. 
locate the German recon team that crashed in that helicopter, it sounds like, and investigate extraterrestrial objects. Sounds fun. I'm excited. Let's go see if we can get our heads into some alien extra. Roger, Voodoo 3 1. Any sign of activity? That's the helicopter. Okay. Set her down. That doesn't look too good. Oh, look at our freaking jet. It's like a Harrier or something. It can hover in place. Very cool. Pretty stacked team, it looks like. Three huge ass buff guys and this Japanese girl. That could still probably kick my ass if she had to. So, yeah, we got a US guy over there. Copy that Delta squad. Japanese First guy, it looks like an Argentina. Dude up front, and I think the other one was a Russian. Delta 1, take point. Take cover behind that debris directly in front of you. Snyder! Yep, see, as you can see, the left stick will control where you want you guys to go. Obviously, the game's just teaching me to go here. But you can see that uh, blue shield. I'm sure they're explaining it further on, but it's only half filled. That means uh, I do have cover, but it is not the best cover. I can still get hit by any gunfire. And um, that shows how many moves you can do. The bottom one, I believe, the little kind of arrow flags looking. Uh, each guy Good. gets two now moves, it looks like, nearby. here right now. And the other um, couple dashes up on top Delta is this two. life bar. Your turn. Move up to the debris. Rodriguez, you gotta move up to the debris. That thing isn't going to offer you much cover, but it's better than nothing. You see this shield? It shows it all the way full. He's in position. max cover. Delta three. He's move gonna to be very hard to hit, and I almost just fall on my chair. That would have been bad. Central, I have movement. Thirty meters north of my position. Police vehicle. Roger. Proceed to the next vehicle for a better vantage point. Come up to this Volkswagen that got demolished by Delta four. Go check it out. It's a long way from your position. Okay. So it so looks like you got some movement there. up here. Let's see what we have. Holy hell. Oh no. Oh man. This guy got four. messed up. Hey, looks he's like done. The recon team, sir. It looks Does like not look something. good. Oh yeah, that's not that good of a sound either. That's someone else. I'll be watching my back. I mean, if we got a dead recon German guy right there, and uh, those are those glowing green orbs that we saw in that opening video. from somewhere north of the squad's current position, based on its strength. doctor. Probably from inside a structure. Thank you, doctor. Obviously, these guys don't know what the heck's going on yet, but we know aliens. And uh, see, it says dashing move. He can move even further out, but it's going to take both of his moves. So he's not going to be able to take a shot or something if you do that. See, that was only one move. And now he still has his other move, so if there was an enemy, I could take a shot at him, but there's not. Oh, yeah. I just found another one of the recons. Yeah, this guy. Oh, what's left of him. But this doesn't make sense. Looks like he's been dead for a week. He got messed up. Looks like something Even came out of him. Even more perplexing is the cause of death. It appears that he was eviscerated when something burst out of him from the inside. Oh, yeah, Sir, see? I have visual the aliens the can get, like, inside you to blood approach. out of your body. That'd be the worst it's way the to go, dude. Just having you. something inside of you? Ugh, right. ugh. Disgusting. Talk to me, soldier. What is it? I got no idea what this thing is, but I can confirm that it's no satellite. Roger. All right, Delta Squad. You're almost to the building. Keep moving. Okay. Gotta move up. Kato. Up to this police car. Okay, people. Now let's get okay, well, we're all outside the building, so now it's Delta time to one. enter it. See, look how cool this is. Let's you have that outside, and then you can go inside buildings and stuff and fight like that. So, um, let's put them up in here. And obviously, we are not stealthy. I'm sure you could play the stealthy, but I'm not going to. Just shatter through the window like a hardcore badass. Just like that. We got Rodriguez here. Take it down. 
Solid He's gonna <laughs> kick down the door and hide behind a fork truck, it looks like. And whoa, boom! What is up? Opening the door for him to move on in. I want you to say his name in the bottom left corner there, because that looked difficult. Um. Yeah, about on the that. Target. It's pretty messed up looking. See, so would you go to that guy right now? Okay, I don't everyone. think I would. Get into position I would tell nearby, him to come to but us. Do not approach. Let's play this safe. Yeah. I mean, come See if you can on, with people. Him. Tell him to drop his weapon. I will try. 